Kim Kardashian made her Saturday Night Live hosting debut this past weekend, and many fans were surprised by her performance. Our pop culture reporter, Sammy Lindell, watched and has lots of thoughts to share with us. What do you have, Sammy? Thanks, Ella. Right from the start of Kim Kardashian's monologue, fans were going crazy as she mocked nearly everyone in her iconic family. But in the days leading up to the show's airing, many were confused as to why she was picked as host. Some said she wasn't fit to be featured as Kim Kardashian doesn't really have a track record of being a comedian. But in my opinion, Kim Kardashian has never failed to give me a laugh because of her nonchalant nature and her petty arguments in her show, Keeping Up With The Kardashians. So I've always thought she's legitimately funny, or maybe my humor is just broken. Now, Kim wasn't too nervous to perform. Maybe she knew this whole time that she would kill the show, and she seemed to have a lot of fun while doing it. Let's take a look. Now, I know we're divided as a country, but I'd love America to come together which is why I'm here to announce that I'm running for, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Kim talked about how her sisters show a photo of her to her plastic surgeons as a reference photo. She shot at her mom's boyfriend, Corey, by calling him a gold digger. She talked about how her father introduced her to O.J. Simpson, yikes, and that her mom is a really smart lady as she did not name any of her children Karen, but Kim questioned how her mom didn't see Caitlyn Jenner coming at all. She said that she married the richest black man in America who is arguably the best rapper, but the only downfall was his personality. There was then an eruption from the crowd, but she said she was told that, quote, comedy comes from the truth and she strives to be genuine. Now, there was some love in the air at SNL as Pete Davidson played Aladdin in a skit and Kim played Jasmine, and Pete actually kissed Kim on set. Everyone took to Twitter to go absolutely ballistic. Overall, people were really pleased with Kim's performance and did not hesitate to talk about it on social media. A tweet went viral that said, Whoever wrote Kim Kardashian's monologue should be nominated for an Emmy. And why is it that every article title about Kim on SNL seems almost shocked by how Miss Kim K completely crushed it? At least I always believed in you, Kim. That's you, Liam.